Hello people, what's up guys? So um, today we will observe one of the coolest website builder service which is called UKIT. So this service is recently new but it's really worth your time. Um, with the help of the UKIT, anyone who wants to build a website without coding and tech skills can do this. So basically you can uh, make a landing page for your service, for your business, for your startup or even a website. As usually uh, all the useful links uh, will be in the description and of course I'm waiting for your likes I'm waiting for your shares and let's get down to our work on the YouTube service just directly right now first of all let's try to understand what actually you can service uh, first of all you need to understand that this is a website builder and it used to launch and manage small businesses websites and other types of projects for personal and commercial use the system has gained worldwide popularity due to its amazing simplicity that does not compromise with quality and professional web design approach. So this is an indescribable solution for new guys and web design pros willing to establish professional web presence for their business. So actually, this website builder uh, will work great for all representatives of small business, of startups, of medium businesses who lack web design experience and don't wish to pay enormous sums of money to web studios so uh to be honest i want to prove you all that it's very simple to work with this uk and uh actually i'm i was in pleasantly surprised because uh here uh you know it's better than the what's in my opinion so that's why i decided to make this video episode for you um, before you actually proceed to the website development process, you need to sign up uh, for this platform. Fortunately, the website builder provides easy, fast and hassle-free registration procedure, so it's possible to choose from two sign-up options here. The first one implies to use of your social account such as Google, LinkedIn, Facebook, yep, if you are, uh, actually have this one, yep. And the second registration option is to fill out the sign-up form providing your email and passport info. And after that you are uh, after the register get registered your account you will see actually your profile and right here you have the opportunity to start your work with UK and basically here we will observe actually the builder we will observe the template first of all uh, right here um, I would say uh, on the left side we have tools uh, and actually this is not tools these are types yeah of um, of templates we need to search uh, and actually these are the examples of uh, these templates for example house and plants let's check the preview so actually uh, here the most part that I adore in this case in the preview that we have the opportunity to observe actually uh, how it will look like uh, in different uh, versions uh, for example desktop tablet smartphones and others so actually right here we have actually uh, desktop version and actually it looks really nice to be honest uh, and all the content is high quality uh, all the images they are colorful they are bright so actually it done in modern way I would say yeah and it's not a landing page actually this is a website here it has uh, the other pages uh, so uh, that we have the other version so that is how it looks for the tablet one yeah for the vertical uh, way yeah uh what we got right here oh, and it's for smartphones of course so it looks pretty nice to be honest and we can start um, we can choose this design of course so um yeah uh of course you need to uh put a domain name but uh you can do this after uh you uh, will create your uh personal web page yep so uh let's right now we will work directly actually with the editor so um uh first of all uh, right now i would like to give you a standard structure of a site which you need to focus on so this is a classic structure of a site. The main thing is to show a services or goods which you need to represent right here. So I'm actually getting to the site. First of all, we see the menu just right here. Yep, we can see a logo, but right here we don't have a logo. We have, I would say, the name yep, of the company. So uh, actually, logo maybe if there is one. If you don't have a logo, you may create your personal logo and just up upload it directly right here. Yep. Yep. 
Uh, so actually the first screen, yep, uh, what we have actually, and this is the first screen, um, which I consider this is the most important because it should attract the attention to the visitor and after all the main companies such as the main body uh, about your service, there should be the information, yep. Um, maybe it should be some contact, yep, uh, forms, I mean, uh, right here, like just subscribe to our newsletter, yep, and a footer, of course. So basically, these are the main parts of uh, each um, website, and not only the website, I mean the landing page. The next one, I would like to show you all how you can actually uh, change the elements, how you can work with this editor. So first of all, you need to understand that working with this editor is very simple thing, because here on this side, you have actually uh, the tools. These are main tools, uh, and actually each tool has its sub-tools, I would say. First of all, this is uh, first one is responsible for the pages. So actually, if you see that, that you need to add some pages, you can add one. And just clicking directly to this page design, yep, you can add a page. Uh, you can you just need to put a title, just a board, a CEO, yep. If you see that this is uh, necess necessary or not, if you just need to delete this page. So actually, you may do this just directly right here, clicking right here, but you can hide it on the desktop version or on the structure, settings of the structure, you will actually uh, check all these blocks, how it should be, yeah, so how you can see it with padding for widgets or not, so basically that's how you need to work. Uh, my lovely part, which is about a design and a builder, of course, because here you can add text, uh, blocks, image blocks, maybe some sliders, for example, just right here, let's check the sliders, uh, all the structure, all the content, so basically here it should be, yep, and uh, design, which is my lovely part, you can create your personal color palette, you can change it to the green one, to the black one, it depends on, of course, you uh, will play around with uh, all the fonts, uh, basically if you will uh, change the font, so basically it changes in all the template, I would say, yep, uh, or if you would like to change it in open sense, and open sense is everywhere, and it's also very important because, you know, you are working with the whole uh, template, not only with the text blocks, because while you're working with all the text blocks, it's very difficult, I would say, because you, for example, one landing page or website may have five text blocks and you just changed uh, a font in only three text blocks, but the other two you forgot to do this, so it's, it's your fault, I would say, yep. Talking about the header, yep, here you have it. Uh, so if we can do directly to this heater, yep, you can change actually uh, the size of this heater. You can make it in bold or not in bold. You can make it italic or not italic. Yep, it depends, of course, how you see it, how you work with it. You can change, of course, with the color. Color you can change to the green one. It all depends on your taste and your imagination, how you see it and how you need to work with it. And first, of, and the last one, you can. Um, work with uh, the adaptive design. That's why right now you are working at the desktop or you may change the desktop to uh, the tablet one or for the mobile one so you will see how it looks like yep and you will uh, change all these elements how you see that they, they are important. So basically that's how you need to work with um, with the design uh, and once again you have right here actually in each section right here you have just like a little menu where you can see formatting you can see the blocks uh, actions so you can duplicate it yep uh, you can check you can add to the image for example if you see that there is no one for example let's work with this image yep we can replace it or we can zoom in or not, so it depends. Um, this is the seal settings. So I would love to uh, change this image background to the other one, and um, I will do this directly right here. You can drag and drop the file from your computer, 
Yep. Um, and for example, uh, unfortunately, I cannot afford that picture that I love to you, but we can choose one from the library, and this is also a cool thing. Uh, we can even stock photos right here, and there are many categories of these stock photos. For example, art objects, let's just absorb some of them. Yep, and uh, maybe we'll pick uh, one picture uh, for uh, this background. Yep. Okay. Actually, I decided to find some pictures uh, with the nature and maybe, maybe let's just take this one and save it. So actually, we have great picture. This and just to uh, play around, break down with this picture, how it will look like. Okay. Okay, once again. Okay, cool. So right now I guess it looks better. So basically we have this picture, yeah, but you need to buy it because it's not for free. And after all, you can play around with all these phones, with all these widgets. Um, the next one. So right now uh, I would like to tell you for what this uh, service is good for me because um, if you are watching my video episode you need to know this. Uh, so actually UKIT is contemporary, convenient and simple website builder uh, which initially targets small and mid-sized business owners. So its feature set is powerful enough to come up to the needs of each user who has an intention to start an effectively managed professional project. So what matters most uh, is that the website builder does not require any coding and web design skills to run quality projects. Everyone can master its intuitive and visual interface to be able to design projects or even the other things. And uh, I would like to actually, uh, I tried to show you that you can work right here in intuitive ways. So you don't need to read some rules how you need to create a cool website because you're just working with each tool and just playing around with this. So actually everyone can master it uh, in an intuitive way, I would say. Um, the website builder comes with an extensive collection of responsive, fully customizable designs tailor made for specific commercial and non-commercial needs, of course. So um, due to the integrated drag and drop functionality, it's possible to start projects of any complexity level without any coding proficiency at all. So these are only some of the most obvious reasons why the platform enjoys popularity with the entrepreneurs or um, creative students, even artists, I would say, photographers, because it's very important to create right now a cool uh, landing page or a website. And if you don't know how to code, actually this service will help you to create really um, cool, modern and in high quality, I would say, all the widgets, um, landing page or even a website. So you will have to spend right here um, from 10 minutes till 2 hours, I guess. It depends on the project. Of course, UKIT has many advantages such as drag and drop editor. Um, it's good for small businesses because it's a website builder. Uh, actually, UK has cool website builder for small businesses. It has simple blogs, um, intuitive dashboards, uh, widget customization. So these are the main advantages of this uh, service. And you may try. You will have this opportunity. So I will love to link to this service. Uh, so it depends on. But if you are interested to create a cool modern uh, website so you may try and so this is the end of this video episode if you would like to see and check the other video, uh, videos uh, about this service uh, about UK uh, so I will make for you the other videos about this 
uh, YouTube service, website builder, and you will track them in my YouTube channel. As usually, thank you for your attention and see ya in another video episode. Bye.